Welcome in once again to the YGO Fresh Off The Press community, where we analyze the current posts, trends, and forecasts of the Yu-Gi-Oh! markets. We're here to feed, feed the endless, eternal Yu-Gi-Oh! market watch cardboard addiction. You guys already know, man, you guys are the MVPs. Hopefully you can feel the energy, the vibes, man. That's what we're all about here. Make sure you subscribe if you enjoy that, if you respect that, if you feel the same way, if you can relate, just click that button. It really helps out the channel. Immediately, we start off with today's content. It's all about penny stocks, more and more penny stocks. We're gonna dig into the 2020 10 of lost memories. Just a couple of stocks that I think you guys can pick out from there. Provide a couple of updates from maze of memories. Look, you got lost memories, maze of memories, fresh off the press memories you know all these type of memories you guys know what i mean um and then we're gonna discuss some battles of legend crystal revenge be because we're gonna get a new battles of legend soon so i just wanted to touch base on a couple of those stonks and then towards the end a card market comparison you know by popular the man so make sure you stay you know tuned for the end of the video but yeah just stonks man this is what my channel is all about i'm considered to be the master penny stonker had a couple of videos here and there analyzing the meta and you know hey i can't forget about my stonks you know what i mean cheap stonks you can't beat that you know usually under a billy there are penny stonks but i do five billies and under you guys already know just great deals on the market right now prismatic secret rares one of my favorite rarities as we can see here starting with striker dragon guys i believe honestly if the bandless you know taps cash and does this and sprites and you know i don't think they're watching konami over there you know dragon links and they've been getting results recently like really recently um these past couple of weekends after sayak has released we do see the demand coming in for cards like uh borlo savage dragons which we've been discussing on the channel and then we also see the demand coming in for striker dragon prismatic secrets you do have another version but i love me some man I just prismatic prismax yo that thing is just too good man i love just fresh off the press just like the channel you guys already know this thing looks clean if you've seen it in person here just above three billies three billy 50 here and there but a lot of one ofs even at four billies wow you know so the card is getting hard to get here we have a, a deal here for 10 billies you can get a place set. but other than that eventually it goes up to five billies so don't let this become like not become a stonk where like it's not a stonk anymore because it's over five billies if you need if you want it now you know uh listings are low as well under 50 so yo dragon links are a real deck it's a combo deck um a lot of people uh, like you know those type of decks things of that nature at that meta scene that competitive scene so it's definitely a card to keep in mind that i could see you know maybe even tens down the line let's see the other look you have an ultra rare first that og print from chaos impact and then a rare budget version only three printings and it's a mainstay link monster in the deck it's very good so make sure that you keep this one in mind then you have time thief redoer you know it's a card that for the past year it was consolidating at a couple of billies bumped up to fours and fives and now as we can see it's back down under three billies if we clean this up janitor style really quick we see look even got deals here at under three billies you know i think i got me like a play set of this card it's just so good looks so nice with the prismatic secrets under 50 listings so don't get confused with a couple of uh, deals here you know because it quickly goes up to four billies and beyond so you know this is a great card it cycles in and out um it does have ultras and supers and other uh budget printings but honestly this is the max rarity the one that looks the nicest and man it makes me want to come in and snipe up a couple of these but let's see what happens but yeah from the 2020 mega tins here i believe this is a very very good opportunity that you guys want to make sure you don't sleep on so great card a rank four generic monster um and it has broken effects so time thief redoer keep that one in mind then same deal goes for gallant granite you do see here consolidating at, at around a billy two billies boom pumped up to four fives and now retracing back down so you know there's a couple of deals here and there but really it's a three billy card so 59 listings only it does have another printing only two versions of this card is a generic search for rocks um and then you know special summon one rock monster from your hand and phase down defense interesting you know you choose one of these but yeah just overall 
great card only two printings you have again the first ed og from chaos impact and then you know cards like these i really like these you know have me a play set of these um because there's when there's only two printings this card comes in cycles in and uh, people need it and there's only two printings in the max rarity prismatics yo look at that artwork man yo would you guys want to face this guy in the dark alley <laughs> nah man <laughs> yo yo that artwork looks nice man but yeah we move on to neil's fusion you do see in the last three months now you see recently a spike you do have a downtrend for the last couple of months off you know the previous highs of four to five billies but now at under two billies man i really like this card quickly goes goes up to two dollars and fifty cents but yeah 76 listings neo's fusion hero card looks beautiful and again same deal with this one you know you have a, a prismatic secret and then a super rare from savage strike that thing is like impossible to get was a very very good set and uh, only two printings i would go with the maximum uh with the max rarity and uh yeah i'm personally working on my r09 i think i have like six of these because it's just too cheap i can see this easily being a five billy card and um <clears throat> after this wall here you know it would keep going on up and yeah five billies that's a 2x i'll take a 2x any day of the week then you have memories of hope um this who's talking about memories man that's what i'm talking about we are ultra rare from 2020 10 of lost memories see a spike as of late you know uh is this good for pure leaves? let's read the effect draw cards equal to the number of well not for pure leaves because they don't have number xes monsters with different names you control but still you know if, if you're playing a number deck i'm um, like numerons or you know um if xes come become prevalent again and you have those big uh, number uh, xes monsters and you have a couple of them on the field or maybe for trains or things of that nature this is yo if you have three trains on the field number um i'm sorry number xc's in the train that you know they use it for the extra deck and things of that nature that's draw three yo that's insane insane as long as you meet the condition draw power really like this stunk you know if we clean this up you know from all that nonsense there two quarters gets you a play set here for a billy 50 not bad guys then it quickly goes up to a billy so that's a deal right there uh, 70 listings under 100 listings and uh, look as you can see people are coming in i have a couple of these i think at least a play set but you know uh it's a good card i really like it from this 2020 uh 10 of lost memories as a stonk and uh it does have a couple of versions but yeah i mean look it has uh, the ultra rare and then you have a super rare so this is max rarity and then dark neo St storm that thing is hard to get man from that set but yeah that's definitely a stonk that i would keep in mind then we have the recus from maze of memories you know with the spell and the xc's i really like these consolidating here i really really like this because let's see before the reprint is it a secret yeah it does it had a secret rare and this thing was money yo it was 40 billies 40 you know what i mean and it's still retaining value at around 50 15 billies so it's down like 60 65 percent i think so that's a lot but yeah with single print when you see demand like that and then you have a reprint that is going to get hard to get of course as an ultra rare lower rarity but yeah look at that consolidation going sideways you want to come in i think i have like one of these or something i want to get at least a play set because uh, you never know. This might be a 5 billy card soon. Maybe even 10s down the line. And you want to take advantage of that 2, 3, possible 4 or 5x. Um, at these prices, 2 billies. It's just too good, man. Definitely a great stonk that I would keep in mind. Same for the spell. You know, uh, let's see. Let's see. It was probably money before the reprint as well. This is consolidating sideways after making the all-time low. Yeah, look at that, guys. Look at that. Let's see. This card was 35 billies just as recent as february this year insane down more than 50 percent as well um and uh yeah i'm always interested when we have a second printing those ogs are still, still too expensive and they're max rarity you know higher rarity like secrets but ultras budget cheap at you know two billies i like it i like it i believe these are undervalued for the long term who knows they might find a new low or whatever if supply keeps coming in and no one cares about these cards but i can see the the potential of these stonks being worth five ten billies down the line so i really like that one then you have the wind up kitten same deal 
only had a single print before reprinted here in maze of memories just recently consolidating near two quarters but here when you come in you see is really a quarter but after these are gobbled up you move into the two quarter range as you can see here if you do near mint though clean this up a tiny bit you do see 150 listings so it was printed you know quite a bit but you see the only other printing used to be uh ultra rare as we can see and here we have uh ultra rare so when they're both ultras um and then you have the fresh off the press and then we're printing that's the way that i would go because this is still four or five bedlies now nah, man getting these for quarters or two quarters when these dry up i believe they're gonna go up to a multiple billy time frame for the long term though we're not talking about any recent moves or things of that nature but it's just a long-term stonk that you want to at quarters man it's just sometimes too easy Woo, man mech knight crusadia avermax from maze of memories love me some avermax just wanted to provide an update we're always constantly talking about this card on the channel love this consolidation at under a billy man of course as you can see here even if we do clean this up janitor style do see 172 listings that's a lot guys i'll be the first one to say it i'll be the the one you know honest here it is what it is but this is a long-term play what i like about this particular play even though it's massively uh, uh reprinted you do see you only have two other why is it doing this um when i click all versions it doesn't put the version that what man tcg player fix that bug but yeah you do have only two other printings i believe so right and it's an ultra high rarities in secret right and then this has a cr though um from this same set but other than that those max rarity versions you know this is this 250 actually yo this is a dollar and some change might not be bad you know yo that's crazy because this one is you know a quarter here a quarter there not bad honestly but 70 cents is where the wall is that would be getting these yeah i didn't know but they're just one of it's hard to pick and choose when buying ones uh sing single cards from these sellers and things of that nature but still man i love avermax is a boss monster link monster broken monster and it's just too cheap again to accumulate at around these prices you know zero percent though but yeah i really love me the stonk just wanted to provide an update same for judgment i've been accumulating these as of late you know trading for them uh purchasing them just trying to stack get my stack up already have the ro9 that i was working on and you see this clear consolidation really like it you have a couple of deals here you know refresh and clean this up as you can see one for 225 but it's really a three billy card and uh, yeah these will be fives in no time of course there's a lot of listings things of that nature but i believe these will be fives pretty sooner rather than later and eventually 10 so it's just easy money man it is it is man it's judgment multi-format card you can use it in go and edison and nowadays it's just a broken card man pick up your judgments don't forget about this one even though remember this is not any official financial advice it's for entertainment purposes only it's always just me expressing my opinion and just what i either am doing or would do so then we have one for one again wanted to provide an update you know to say that even though it popped up to almost a billion now it's retracing back down the supply is coming in so i wanted to make sure that you guys kept this deal in mind where you can see here after this is cleaned up is back down to 50 cents two quarters you have a couple of deals here before 60 cents once again but i really really like this card for the long term again multi-format card as well 150 listings but yeah one for ones are all money of course this one just got recently reprinted is out there for everyone but amazing defenders is not the set that was most widely opened or consumed so i really really like this stonk i do i mention it all the time just wanted to provide an update to let you guys know that you there's some deals going on right now some deals cooking if you want you can come in and take advantage of that guys don't forget link in the description down below to our link tree we've centralized everything the boys over at the semi-limited podcast great job over there there's some podcasts that i participated in already on a commute if you want to consume those but yeah a long commute yeah like driving whatever but yeah here's our socials guys we have the discord is popping off remember if you join make sure you read the rule reds uh uh role so that you can obtain that and not get kicked out within 10 minutes we have the twitters you know that's been um joining some people same for instagram we've been posting our shorts over at tiktok if that's easier for you guys to consume we have facebook just everything make sure you get you guys check out our socials we are continually working on those to put out 
and push out our content over there don't forget guys this saturday between it's like at 10 45 that's what i've said eastern time tune in guys 10 45 saturday night you know after you chilled with the family did all that good stuff pop in because we're going to be choosing five winners five 10 billy gift cards for you guys and maybe a small surprise as well so stay tuned for that you know what i mean uh yeah that's coming this saturday just in a couple of days let's you know enjoy the chit chat the chat let's get it on fire back and forth answering all your questions it's fun man i've had a couple of those already i've had a blast so if you want to participate if you can make it make sure you keep that in mind saturday at 10 45 p.m eastern time and all you have to do to participate in the giveaway come over here ensure that you're subscribed and then we're gonna have a fresh friday feature tomorrow on that video just leave a comment any comment you want i'll be selecting the winners from those comments also guys uh, make sure that you click that notification bell to keep up and stay tuned with our latest and greatest fresh off the press videos and like this video as it really does help out with the channel with the algorithm just to find great people like you guys so you know i just want to thank you so much man you guys are the mvps the support man just look at that man almost at 1.1k already i just cracked that thing like a couple of days ago and look videos back to back to back 1k videos yo and then you have a couple of here where are you 2k man this community you guys are the mvps man come on man pat in the back right here you guys are too much man it's humbling man thank you so much you yo let, let's just keep going uh, chaos space secret rare from battles of legend crystal revenge i talked about this card you know in our market watches here and there wanted to provide an update at around three billies as we can see stabilizing there, consolidating at 147 listing this is the time you know after a couple of weeks a month here and there this is the time if you need or want chaos space i would get it now because you just never know when that ban list comes out dragon links become tier one again and it's a mainstay deck you know you want to make sure that you have access to chaos space just such a great card man just such a great card only two printings you don't want secret rares from toon chaos you want secret rare max rarity chaos spaces i have me definitely an r9 and some extras really enjoy this card same for fusion destiny it was making new local highs in the three month price at around you know two dollars and fifty cents almost three almost three billies and recently you see this dump supply coming back in providing some deals under two billies but yeah then eventually it quickly goes back up to two billies massively reprinted though at over 200 listings so keep that in mind yikes but still i have like 20 or 25 of these because i believe in the long term this is just easy pickings easy money why because it's a secret rare mid max right under the ot and it's a hero card man this is gonna age well just like fine wine you know make sure you guys have your copies and uh yeah just wanted to provide an update and then a couple of edison cards with vayu and with revived king Hades. this was the short of the day the card of the moment make sure you guys could check that out short form content but here we're going to review it it's a short printed card from battles of legend crystal revenge that everyone's forgot about already no one's looking at this no one hey edison hype is here right now look this card was two dollars and almost 50 cents at one point consolidating near the lows at around billies and under this is definitely a deal as you can see when that sniped up a lot of one ofs you know at about a billy and uh we clean yeah it's cleaned up yeah 106 listings we go to the second page where's the next one where's the next five here at a billy 17 wow gamer's choice has that massive wall at a billy 30 but that's up like 40 percent from the current lows, guys so you want to get in now at under a billy it's just easy future money short printed this card only has a couple of you know uh, uh printings with an ultra and an ot they're all hard, hard to get and this is gonna get hard to get when people forget about this set they already forgot about this card i have a stack of these like 40 or 50 of these because they're short printed and i can see you know edison is continuing to grow and this is a, a very well used card in the zombie strategy and things of that nature so definitely a card to keep in mind for edison same for value black wings are super popular in edison it was a very viable very good deck back in the day and a lot of people were playing these of course again massively reprinted this one wasn't short printed like um revive king was um you do see a deal here but really it's a two-quarter card is been in came out and as you can see here's just consolidation this is an extremely long-term play but value is a wing beast tuner level one 
just such a great card it doesn't have an it does have an, an ulti and another secret and a super and things of that nature but this secret rare fresh off the press just recently reprinted you know if i got yeah at least 50 of these maybe 100 man but it's just future money man sometimes i like going big on stunts like these is a risk is a gamble you're never gonna truly know but i really do you know enjoy doing so so you have card market here to end the video we're going to talk about draw and lock bird and time tearing morganite again guys you know i'm not a card market expert do i need to sign up i might be able you know to need to sign up here create an account even though i'm not going to order cards maybe it unlocks you know other features of the website so leave a comment down below those from europe around the world you know how does this work do i need to sign in is all new to me but we're trying just to implement a small part small section into the market watches leave your feedback guys constructive feedback we're always trying to change things around we're here to change the game and provide that different quality market watch you know that's where you that's why you guys are here so draw and lock bird here what i like you know things we can see in common between tcg player is the charts and card market as we see is them charts look at that just pumping into oblivion the demand is worldwide as you can see here not just over here in the tcg you know in the states and then the regular tcg markets but overall worldwide in europe everywhere the demand for drill is here that's why i love my pick with drill of course this might get reprinted in the tens but that's far out before then we'll, we'll you know get rid of all of these but the demand is here heading into nat season people are hyped you know and and that season is everywhere nationals in europe and in the states and in south america central america just all over the world so drill is a highly demanded card and how do i do this guys here in card market are these the listings man because <laughs> it just all seems too weird you do have sellers i don't know what that number okay that's the amount of sales uh you know what is it that they have one first okay here's the quantity okay a lot of ones and twos before you know the six wall here i'm on the fly man we're just good at this at doing market watches man if you enjoying it having fun like this video man leave a comment below of what you think hopefully you guys are enjoying the content but yeah you have a six wall here two play sets a play set here but a lot of one-ups a lot of one-ups show more results let's see if we can pop keep this in here um man yo come on card mark i know i'm not in europe but but yeah while that loads as we can see a lot of one ofs over here in card market you know but overall all in all the market price is going up and while that pops up you know we have drill over here again we talked about this retracement off 455 billies back down to threes and now we see that spike again recently just that second leg up that's what i'm waiting for to reach you know 10 billies or something like that you imagine yo that'd be crazy but the commons are like five to sixes already so you know honestly excuse me as a rare i wouldn't be surprised as we can see here 370 massive walls and quickly becomes i mean there is a hundred wall here as a wall of china man as you can see there but eventually it's a four billy card again i still under 100 listings this card ain't going nowhere but up in my humble opinion and uh yeah that thing just stays stuck there but yeah man over there just focusing mostly on the charts as we can see it's pumping up as well really keep drool in mind and then same for time tearing morganite we saw a pump from a billion some change euros obviously up to four four fifteen same over here where you saw that pump up to four fifty five billies similar prices you know now you see a little bit of consolidation here and here you're seeing a spike back up as we can see you know you have a deal there but really is a four four fifty card here over in the tcg almost under 100 listings the demand is too great man it's just the card is too good so over there as well in card market we can see consolidation here a lot of one ofs here as well and i'm not even going to click this button you guys already know man um, but yeah let me know if i need to sign up really what i'm gonna do here is just analyze the charts a couple of listings i guess these are a couple of deals at one ofs but i don't know the condition like to buy and if it's a certain amount whatever but you know we'll learn as i go i think I'll, I'll make an account and just go as we go guys if you enjoyed the content make sure you like this video man i'm just humbled so much support from the community the growth is insane i can't believe i'm pumping out 1k videos on the daily now and it's all thanks to you you guys are finding value enjoying the market watches and that's what we're here for thank you so much for your support your comments it means a lot to me i check every single comment you know and just the likes the videos man breaking all time highs just the growth continues and uh, just make sure you click that bell you subscribe stay tuned for our live stream coming very very soon giveaways we're gonna have fun on there we're gonna be opening this as well on there just for the funsies to see what qcsr quarter century secret rare 
Oh, you know, open, so stay tuned for that. And a surprise as well. I forgot to mention this, guys, here. Look, I said that I bought um, uh, Catastor and Colossal Fighter for 20 billies. It was like 25, 26, 28, you know, easy money. These are worth triple digits now. So, yeah, that's crazy. That was just in February. Where is it? 2020, uh, January 24, 2021. Man, that was two years ago already and some change. Man, that was a long time ago. But, yeah easy money man hopefully you guys are having a blast. let me let y'all get out of here man hopefully you enjoyed today's content if you stayed out to this point you guys are the best man the mvps the og staying to the end you guys man thank you so much thank you so much all right jay let these people get out of here thank you so much for your time for your support and for your attention hope you guys have a good one